Dr. Ben Brown, a general surgeon at Shannon Medical Center, knew he wanted to work in medicine after beating cancer while he was in college. For this week's Contro Careers, I got to scrub in and learn what it takes to be a general surgeon. For surgery, you do your four years of college, you do your four years of medical school, and then five years of residency after that. Um, within residency, you do certain kind of subspecialty trainings, and one of them that you can do is for minimally invasive surgery or robotic surgery, which is like doing the big operations through the little operations. Dr. Brown attended medical school at UT Southwestern in Dallas. You kind of apply all around the country, you apply to several dozen schools, and then it's a match process, so you just kind of find out where you're going. Once accepted and matched with your school, the hard work begins. Definitely something you've got to prepare for, and it's something you've got to be serious about. It locks in. Um, it can be a very stressful situation, very stressful day-to-day -day life and job and training, and it really has to be something that you are sure about. Over the last two years, Dr. Brown has completed 326 robotic cases at Shannon Medical Center, but there is never a typical day as a general surgeon. A lot of times we're in the operating room all day, um, usually from about, you know, 7 in the morning until about 4 or 5 in the afternoon, sometimes longer. Um, sometimes we're in the office and clinics seeing patients, seeing the people we've operated on, um, telling people about operations and if it's, you know, something they want to do. Um, and then sometimes we're on call for the ER. And and that's where for 24, 48, you know, hours, if there's anybody who comes in with an emergency or a trauma or anything, then we get called and go down, take care of them there. After years of schooling and the everyday practice, learning never stops as a doctor. Uh, it's important we, we all stay up on conferences, different trainings, different operations. The number one operation that I do here at Shannon now, I didn't do until two years ago. So uh, it's, you know, staying abreast of new developments and surgeries is important. For Contra Careers, I'm Erin Bailey.